Hello Taurus, welcome to your bonus reading from May 2020, how they feel about you. You can get this reading just for your energy on my website. My website is showing here or in the description you have my website and my email address if you want a personal reading. All right, how, how they feel about Taurus in the month of May. Ooh, four wands. Some of you, this person wants to message you to take you out. In some parts, you may be able to go out. Some countries are easing up this lockdown. So you may be able to go somewhere, have some fun. But um, others of you, the four ones is stability, a relationship commitment but this person is thinking that you or them they have um, quite little to offer yeah so crowning them and how they feel deep down the moon so they may be a bit confused about you because sometimes they may feel that you you want a relationship and then you don't or vice versa, okay, the energy can be as well, this person feeling like that towards you, or uh, you sense that they're a bit on and off, so maybe you actually uh, giving out that message to them as well, you're not sure. Uh, but I do see some of you have a child with this person, or someone really wants a relationship and children with you yeah a Gemini Libra Aquarius or even a Pisces as well could be a Cancer too <clears throat> but they want the truth deep down they want to uh, to tell you the truth tell you how they feel and they also want to hear what do you want from the relationship with the will and the knight of cups it's someone that maybe rejected you or you rejected because it wasn't the right time and now this is a new beginning but someone is really struggling to wants to have this relationship with you but deep down there's some anxiety or they feel they're unable to start this relationship with you They could also be confused because you're giving them mixed messages. Uh, you may be torn between two. What they're going to do, Taurus, what he or she is going to do. Okay, the Hierophant, it could be another Taurus. Some of you are dealing with another Taurus. But look, marriage, commitment. They want marriage with you. They want commitment, strong commitment. What's the exterior? The Two of Swords, there's, uh, well, someone is making a decision. The Five of Swords reversed. So, Two of Swords and the Five of Swords reversed. Ending a conflict. Some of you may be arguing a lot. Someone has a lot on their mind, a lot on their plate right now, and they just want to, you know, just just want to think. Just, they just want things to be okay with you. Three to six weeks. How they feel about Taurus? Okay, we've got a Leo here. But whoa, look at this long term. They're making plans with you, future plans. Is someone that is not giving up, is very strong, determined. They could be physically strong.
There could be some of you that could be a Leo or a Libra that is your competition or their competition. Justice. Okay, there is a lot of conflict and you see that's why you've separated and you're actually competing with each other. Sometimes these arguments are very, um, you may be hurting each other, maybe doing things to, to hurt each other. You're both doing it, some, some of you, not all. This could be an Aquarius. But look, you need to communicate your wishes here. I feel that's going to be, um, it's telling you to also do some prayer affirmations to get what you wish from this situation. I do see communication and this long term. Yeah, some of you, it's Gemini reconciliation. Making a head of a heart decision. And you could have to do that to, this could be in June, you could, you're going to be together in June, Gemini season. Also some of you, it's your twin flame coming back, four wands, clarify this for Taurus, how they feel about Taurus. Okay, so there's a lot of party and the Three of Cups here. They definitely want a relationship and want you to ease down on going out a lot. Or they're, uh, um, you know, they're, this is also celebration. You may have a celebration. Well, it could have been your birthday. You celebrated with this person. Or you're going to. On your mind, uh, on their mind, sorry, on their mind is, yeah, again, the five of wands, there is, um, some of you have been trying to get pregnant, they've been trying to get you pregnant. Also, with the five of ones, could be the baby mom, a baby mom, or a, um, the mother of their children, or your 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 child's father or mother, um, creating some drama. So, if you have children from a, a previous relationship, this could be something that's on their mind all the time, or vice versa. Okay. How they feel about Taurus in the month of May. I feel, yeah, as well here, they want you to keep an open mind because of finances or career, or they're actually keeping an open mind if you're struggling or have been struggling. And they kept an open mind. They didn't really care about how much you make, or they want you to... They're thinking about uh, this. They want you to be to have an open mind, especially around finances and their career as well. Like I said here with the Page of Pentacles, I feel someone here doesn't feels that they don't have enough to give. They don't have enough to give. Could be financially, and there has to be a heart to heart conversation, especially if you have children and even children from previous relationship. It's a, a big responsibility to take on the, well, I'm sure this person feels like this. They, they're going to take on a responsibility here, especially if there's children involved. So there's a need to honestly discuss your feelings with each other and codependency. Yeah, could be addictions as well affecting or have affected your love life. Um, but depending on each other or one depending on the other it could be money issues Capricorn energy children and passion so also I feel that someone wants to do the right thing wants to have children when it's the right time 
and if there is a difference of age, for some of you it's nothing to do with children, they are younger or you, um, you are the younger here, yeah, another, another earth sign, Taurus, Virgo or Capricorn, um, they may be kind of thinking or, uh, you know, keeping an open mind, it's not really the ideal because you're young or they are young and they don't have a career. There's something uh, along these lines around finances and career. One is not ready to take on big relationship or a responsibility of having children uh, as well. All right. So someone could even live with friends. Doesn't have their own house, their own home. Um, so, yeah, this is your reading. I hope it helps. And if you need a personal reading, everything is on my website in the description below this video. Thank you so much, Taurus. Happy birthday again and take care. Bye-bye.